Ladies and gentlemen, yes. The whole culture of the school changes once we've been there two years. The whole culture changes because suddenly the, uh, the children start to behave a bit better going, in the, going through the hallways. Um, the, even the custodian people see a big difference in the children. And, um, and then that particular child would have had a brother and sister so they are not in third grade, if they're in fifth grade or whatever it is. So they are now looking forward to board and dancing when they're in fifth grade. They have to wait. Because all of these children are given homework to teach somebody at home, to teach a mother, a father, a brother, a sister, a cat, a dog. You know, I mean, it, 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 we use these expressions for them so that they can have fun and then, then go and do something with them. Try to teach a dog to dance. I mean, but at least they're trying, you know? <laughs> which is really good. So yes, the whole culture does change. But at the same time, I must be upfront and honest. We are a partner with that school. If I'm gonna dance with you as a partner, we have to be able to move to the same beat. If the school principal takes us, pays for us, and does not have an interest in her classroom teachers, uh, we, want, we need the classroom teachers to be participants in the class and the dance with. They cannot be sitting down in the front or doing the nails, whatever it is. They've got to be actually physically participating because that teacher is a parent figure of, that, of, of those boys and girls. And so they can then take the information that they're learning about the, uh, the history, the, civil, the geography of Cuba, whatever, back to the classroom and work on that with them. If it's a good dancing, if it's a good classroom teacher. So, if that doesn't happen, and there is, a, there is a disconnect now and again, but with all due respect to any principals here or school teachers, that person, that school then is red flagged for us. We will now go and have a debrief with them. Do you want us again? This is what happened. This was good. This was not so good. Can we please, if you want us again, we need to have this. We are a team together. We want you paying a lot of money for this course of ours, so we need to be giving you the best possible product. And so to answer your question, in 99% of the cases, it happens across the whole schools. But there are a few schools that we do rep. We have a really tight ship. We call it a quality control, but I like to call it quality support. We need to send our teaching artists to support them, to make sure that the school is giving us what they promised, as far as where are we going to be holding the class? Is it in the auditorium? Is it in the gym? Is it, or it cannot be in a hallway where people are passing by. And um, so that is that. Then we need to also make sure that our teachers are giving the school what we promised them. And so, but when, but when the two things really come together, like a good partnership, it works beautifully.